Hey YouTube, the good old Browning Synergy uh, gun I was working on, doing a little research when I had to um, replace firing pins and I, I ran across another little trick on the web um, that I thought was kind of cool that uh, nobody seems to have done a video on before and that is converting the ejectors to extractors. So I'm going to just do a quick video here and show you how to do that. Very simple, just uh, again, take the forearm off the gun. Let's see if I can get this to focus here and follow me. Um, all you're going to need for this is a little handy dandy uh, pocket screwdriver. And you go in here and simply push down on this little lever, insert a screwdriver there to hold it, and then literally this piece will just pop right out if you flip that around. So this little piece here comes out, leave that out. You can do the same on the other side. Okay, let's see if I can focus this here. Push this little lever down right here. Stick the screwdriver in. And then this piece will flip right out of here if you just kind of tap the gun a little bit. there you have it. You just leave those two pieces out, put the gun back together, and now when you break it open, these will just come up real slow so you can pull your shells out at the trap line like you want. Um, to put it back together and have it be ejectors again, you would simply just reinstall these. Um, again, come here, push down with your finger, insert a little pocket screwdriver in here and then grab these little things now you got to be careful which one you put in there are two little dents in these or on each one Let's see if i can focus this see where i'm po pointing to here see this little divot this little dot that needs to be so that you can see it um, on the outside of the gun got the wrong one here Simple as that. Slap these back in there. Sorry for those bad camera angles and my shakiness, but again, put the screwdriver in, take your little piece with a dot so that you can see it, and then line up the little hole, and it's just held in there with pressure like that. So then once they're back together, back into the gun, and now you've got back to ejectors. So hope that helps somebody out. Thanks for watching.